Hey guys, Sportshot here, and today we're playing Fire Team. This is the second time I've recorded today. Um, the only reason I stopped recording yesterday is because while we were um, sniping some people, my dad came in and he said, uh, Hey, yeah, I just wanted to tell you that we're back and that we're gonna leave again. So, yeah. He just pops into my recording room randomly. Um, yeah. I have a lock on the door, but it would be rude to kind of lock it, I guess. But. If you're wondering what that crunching noise is, I'm currently eating. Right now, I'm currently eating some carrots and hummus. Tastes pretty nice. Oh, yeah. We're fighting an ally right now. That is a fellow Russian soldier. Wait. What? Oh my god. We were distracted by our own teammate. And then the other guy came up. You see, this is why you don't put kids into combat, because they can't. Okay, roll. I'll do squad leader ult. Deploy at rally point. Oh, uh, we don't own the rally point. I gotta fight for it. No, I put too much, too much hummus on that carrot. It'd be nice if they added some scoped weapons, such as a maybe like an SVDS or just a standard SVD. For the Russians, um, wait, is the sun going down? Yes, okay, that's bad. It's like an SVD or an SVDS or maybe an SKS for the Russians with a PU scope on it. And then for the Americans, maybe something more of like a Mark 11 or some AR build or maybe something else. Like light marksman rifles. Shots coming in. Um. An ally. I'm gonna turn up my graphics a little bit so I can see. And let's look. It's an ally down there. See, right now I'm playing as a squad officer. So I have all of these logistics tools, like a binoculars or maps or all that stuff. Oh, if you haven't guessed, my English isn't that good. Oh, and if you ever see me look down like this, I'm trying to look up, because, say like, on my screen at least, that tree, it's smaller, getting bigger, getting bigger, so it kind of helps me scope in. So I have to turn on my night goggles, turn them off actually, okay, so if I'm gonna raid this building I need to have my night goggles on, so I can't see, so I have to turn my settings down a little bit, so I'll turn them down to 1 since you don't need much render distance to raid a building. There are literally supplies everywhere but I don't know how to use them. Okay. Okay, we're down here. Let's turn off our NVGs. Turn that up. Let's see, so yeah, our objective is to capture the rally point. What? Okay. 
So I can't look through these with night vision on, but I also can't see through them without the night vision. I mean, I can, but it's very hard to see. Okay, I'm seeing some green tracers, or Russian tracers, out near there. Since there is no fall damage, which is kind of broken, I can just jump off the building and... Seeing engagement. Yeah, so there is an engagement. Um, I see allies. Yeah, isn't AKS? <coughs> okay. See, what I don't get is, unless we're fighting to keep our, um, puppet nations in, um, I mean, no, this has to be the fall of the Soviet Union after that. So this must take place in the Ukrainian war, but in the Ukrainian war, only special operations used, um, AKMs, because they were such outdated rifles used for only extremely specific things. So, yeah, we should be using something along the lines of an AK-12 or an AKM, but, you know, whatever. You win some, you lose some. I would not advise raiding a building with binoculars. It's um, not a very good offensive weapon. Oh, and if you hear anything going on in the background, those are guns. <clears throat> I think I'll just camp out on the roof for the rest of the night. Because the sun or the moon is um, lowering pretty quick. Someone's firing their gun off over there like it's a Pakistani wedding. Let me go investigate. I don't see any people. Okay, so uh, day daybreak is coming. Nice at least, oh, shots. What's nice at least is that the Americans wear bright khaki uniforms, so you can see them in this um, temperate forest. I'm going to forward up to the enemy base, which I believe is this way. Wait a second. Uh-huh. Okay. It's me versus two others. Hopefully more people join soon. So yeah, it's this way. hearing shots from over here, so I might as well <coughs> go over here and look at what's going on. So yeah, um, if you want to check out this game, I'll put a link to it in the description of the first video. Um, 
<laughs> that lasted long. That lasted long, yeah. Let me just reset. Oh, a lot more people have rejoined. That's nice. Still the only one in the Russia team. Be a normal leader. I wonder what's the difference between the alt and the normal leader. Oh. You've got to be kidding me. So the normal leaders had a scope the whole time. Mm-hmm. 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 The whole time I was stuck here without any optics. My god. At least now I know. You seem to have less camera shake when you're running with a pistol for some reason. <laughs> I'm not seeing anything. There's people out there and know that at least. I'm gonna take out my rifle. Okay, I thought I saw somebody's backpack there. It's just another supply crate. Um. Hopefully they don't know that I'm coming either. Something that I don't really like about this game is that the scope sways way too much to be realistic. Well, at least for me. Because when I I have a uh, BB gun, and whenever I know it's not exactly the best comparison, but this gun in the game would be a lot heavier than the BB gun that I have, and I still don't have as much sway on my BB gun, so the sway needs to be buffed so that there isn't as much. Okay, so I think we have enemies at alpha. So these sounds are the creaking stones of the uh, metal stumps, not gunfire. Gunfire is fully dynamic. Okay. Let me see if I'm spot on anybody. No, okay. I think I'll head to the uh, enemy base. Actually, the Americans do have a Camouflage advantage over it. Is that a person in that building? No, it's not. Okay. I thought there was a person in that building right there. So, the Americans do have a camouflage. Um, uh, they have better... Um, they have better camouflage, but they have worse scopes. Their scopes are... The sights are just huge. Like, they're rectical. Let me check the map. Okay. 
Okay, so I'm going over here. Because I want to get to the enemy base. And if you realize me being quiet for longer periods of time, that's just because I'm trying to remain, I don't know. I'm just used to uh, not talking as much when I'm trying to be focused, but, this, you know, I'm not, well, I am new to the whole YouTube thing, and uh, I'm not good at keeping up conversation while I'm trying to carry out a task. So, yeah. So we are right near the enemy base. Uh, I hope you can swim, because I'm about to try. So let's try to swim. Well, that's great. Well, water just instantly kills you. It's just... Mmm. Simply delicious. That's just great, you know, dying when you step in water. I think if they added vehicles to the game, it would be a lot better, but... I don't know, I think I'm going to stop playing right now because I'm getting kind of tired. So yeah, if you liked the video, leave a like, remember to like, comment, subscribe. Um, yeah, you should have a nice day. Um, if you comment on the video, the best comment will get a shout-out in my next video. But there has to be more than ten comments on separate accounts for that to happen. Also, I am looking for a video editor, so if anybody can do that, they won't get paid because I don't have money, but... I'll give you credit and I'll give you shout outs. So yeah, it's a pretty good deal. Have a nice day. Oh wait. Okay, we have a dead soldier here. I don't know how to reheal them, but Nice little game feature, you can uh, waste mags, but, so yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave this to this. Um, have a nice day. See you in the next video.